In this video, I show you how to enable virtualization on Windows 11 or 10 and previous versions as well. If you're new to the channel, please go down below and consider subscribing. And once you've done that, please go down below and consider leaving a like. And let's jump straight into this guide. Here we are on my PC and the first thing you need to do is go and press on the start button just like so and then go and press on the power button and go and tap on it. And as you can see, we've got sleep, shut down and restart. And what you need to do is go and click on restart while holding shift. If you don't, it's not going to activate something called the Windows Safe Mode, which we need. So I'm going to go and press on Restart while holding Shift, which I'm doing just now. And as you can see, it says, please wait, and it should shortly say restarting. And your PC will restart and you'll be taken to this screen here. For some reason, it's gone on my other monitor, but that doesn't matter. So what you want to do is go and tap on Troubleshoot, and then you want to go and click Advanced Options. And then what you need to do is come on to this option here, the UEFI firmware settings, just there. And then all you need to do is go and press restart. And what the UEFI firmware settings are, is basically your motherboard settings. So then all you need to do is go and tap on restart, just like so. And your PC will once again restart. And then your motherboard is going to load. And I'll show you what that looks like. And now here we are on my motherboard. But now what's really important to know is, is that every motherboard and the settings in the BIOS are going to look different. But they're all very similar. And they're going to have the main key things which you need um, to go and change your virtualization settings. So personally, I'm using an AMD motherboard but it does not matter I'm going to explain how to do this on all types of motherboards and explain the exact steps you need to go and take so it's important to note that um, the virtualization setting is going to be called different things on different types of CPUs so I'm just going to quickly read off what they may be called so if you're using an Intel based motherboard then the different terms for the virtualization setting may be Intel VTX, Intel virtualization technology, virtualization extensions and Vanderpool and if you're using an AMD motherboard then the setting may be called an SVM MD virtualization technology or Vanderpool once again. But as I said before, you need to go and open your CPU settings. So if you're using this MSI motherboard, you need to go to um, the overclocking settings, just like that. And then what you need to do is go to CPU features, just at the bottom, just here. And then from here, you need to go and look for SVM mode, which is just here in this list. So go and tap on it, just like so. And then you can either go and disable it or enable it. And of course, you want to go and be enabled. And that's going to be virtualization. As I said before, this is called many different things. On AMD, it's commonly called SVM, and that's just what it's called. But on Intel-based motherboards, it may be different. Um, but this is the AMD version. But as I said before, if you're using Windows, go and look for your CPU settings, and it may be just be called virtualization. But basically, get your CPU settings, which may be in the um, overclocking settings here, but also there may just be a CPU settings as an option on the side here as well. And then all you want to do is press on the cross in the top, just like so, and do make sure you go and save any changes you have made. I haven't actually changed any because my virtualization and SDM mode was already enabled. So go and press yes, just like so. And then your PC is going to go and restart on Windows will load normally with virtualization enabled and you can do whatever you'd like with it. If you found this guide useful, please go down below and consider subscribing to the channel. Leave a like for more. Peace.